and let's begin explaining the time liner. Home and time liner. But in first, let's open our file from our library, material, folder 6, and this file. OK. And let's activate the time liner. And now let's look into the ideas. In first, what we're going to get. We want to get some kind of animation of our direction of our building. So from one task to another task, from foundation to columns to walls, and then to examine all the processes during the animation. So first we have to make a tasks. We're going to make them in the left part of this menu. Okay, tasks and add the first one and let's name it. Let's name it like a foundation. Foundation, the next task. Columns and seal columns. And if we need to delete, okay, let's press and delete this task. The next thing we should um, edit is the plan start and end start. Plan start and plan end. Okay, when we click this this point, this, uh, we can go to the calendar and choose a date. Okay, this one and plan end. For example, this one. Then plan start for second task. This one and the next is this one and the next is this one and one more okay now we have some kind of calendar of our building erection from the beginning from the foundation to two columns and then to get the animation we have to take some objects from the module and attach them to this to the thing to these tasks Foundations to foundations, columns to columns. And let's use the sets, sets, and take the foundations, and then go to foundation task, and then press right button, and attach current selection. And now, as you can see, we can see this, this element in any time that they were attached to this task. And the next one, yeah. Concrete columns, and go to this one, press the right button, attach current selection, or attach current search, as you need. And the last one, steel columns. And now we're almost ready, but we have to do one thing more. We have to tell the nervous box that we want all these elements to be constructed, not to be demolished, not to be destroyed, but constructed. And so we have to choose the right thing for this test type. Construct, construct, construct. And as you can see in the right part of this menu, we can see the Gantt, the Gantt chart for all these processes. The first one, the second one, and the third one, and then we want to get the animation of the construction of our building. So let's go to simulate, and here it's pretty ready to start. Let's check the dates in settings, settings and dates. It's okay. Now press play. And now, as you can see, everything is green, and now it's going to happen something. Yeah, as you can see, I, I press pause, and now, at this, at this day, at Friday, at, at this time, and uh, the nine days, the second week, 
the foundations is really ready. It's planned chart and the columns are getting to be ready. So they're now in process because they're fly green. And then let's press green one. And now concrete columns are ready. They were constructed in plan and now the steel columns are under construction. And now they're, they're going to be finished. Okay. And the main idea is that we're making tasks, we're making dates, and then we're changing the task type and attach some elements or some sets of elements to this task. And after that we can get the simulation for the construction. And in the future videos we are going to look into the all the settings and ideas how to make it better.